Good morning on June the 2nd. Bitcoin update, three minutes. What happened and we? why are we back in the range? Mm, yesterday's update, I showed you that I was looking for this kind of move and expecting one more leg up, which uh, yeah seemed to me reasonable and uh, take out these highs and then into this demand zone, uh, sorry, supply zone and then going down. Um, we didn't get there and the move yesterday was uh, typical for what we have seen so many times the past months. You do get a correct, uh, let me remove this one first. Uh, we start a very slow day with uh, a corrective move and then suddenly acceleration to the downside. Yesterday I uh, updated on uh, my tweets, I said once we were already there, I, I was hoping for such a bearish retest uh, because also in yesterday's um, update I said if we break down here and do some kind of bearish retest, I do think that move to the upside is already finished. Well, we never got that retest. And uh, yeah, typically for Bitcoin, it just uh, it just crashed lower uh, pretty fast. And uh, we are now actually in that second bounce, which uh, yeah, again, looks corrective to me and uh, expecting more downside. Before I go into Bitcoin, I show you on Ether why. And if you follow me more often, then you do know that I am calling already for a couple of weeks that Bitcoin already took out the weekly lows from June 21, uh, but Ether didn't, and that I still expect that it to happen. Mm, yeah, that we, we could have been starting that move right, right here. And even if you draw something like uh, Elliott Wave, you could say this is uh, one, two, three, four, five. I didn't look at the bigger picture, but uh, well, yeah, then I do see here the downtrend corrective bounce in a one, two, three, and then one, two, three, four, five. Something like that is what I expect now. Back to Bitcoin. So in the middle of that range, I do think that Bitcoin has a good chance of, of not making new lows like here. Uh, while Ether looks weaker to me and that Ether goes for those lows, while Bitcoin, yeah, also, um, uh, bouncing first and then coming down, but I do think not that big as, uh, not, not that much down like I expect Ether to do. And this is the range I'm watching. Uh, this is a supply zone. I do think we do an A, B, C into this zone. If we do get a reaction here to the downside, I'll look for a short, uh, but maybe the better trade now is Ether. Um, that's it for now. We are past three minutes. Time to stop and wish you all a very nice day. See you tomorrow.